Baile folklorico is a tradition and the main dance of Mexico. In different parts of Mexico, it is danced a bit different ways, and the dancers dress a bit different. An easier way of saying names of the dance is folk dancing. Baile folklorico has been danced by women in the past. Now it can be danced by men too. This dance is popular in different parts of Mexico and sometimes is danced differently. Ballet for Glorico is danced with mariachis. They make the music. The dance is most popular in Nuevo Leon, Venacruz, Jalisco, and Nayarit. The men and women are dressed completely different, but it goes well together and with where they are performing like festivals, parades, and parties, weekly performances on Wednesdays and Sundays. In fact, the president enjoyed the dance so much he made schools specifically for the dance. There are at least 30 different ballet folklorico dance schools in all Mexico. Different parts of Mexico dance ballet folklorico different ways. Some parts are Nuevo León, Veracruz, Jalisco, Nayarit, Guerrero, Michoacán, Yucatán, San Luis Potosí, Chiapas, and Puebla. They are all the same but are danced different. The wardrobe is the colors of the flag but same design. But the way danced is the different. Amelia Hernandez was the woman at who invented Ballet Folklorico. She funded at least 30 schools. Ballet Folklorico was popularized in the 1950s and 1970s. Ballet Folklorico can be danced by different genders. Women have special kinds of dresses that are long and wavy. The hair is braided with a white, red, or green ribbon, or the color of their flag. The man wears a mariachi costume or the traditional costume of their state. The man wears a hat, usually of the colors of the costume. The costume is either black, white, or gold. First step in El Son de la Negra is called carretilla. And in carretilla, what you do is you do two flats with each foot. And you make sure that you keep your feet completely flat on the ground. For some reason, people have a tendency of doing heel first, but it should be completely flat. Make sure that you keep your knees bent, have a little bit of a spring, so that way, when you do put on the music and you go full speed, you can go as fast as the music. So moving on, now we have a step called alternating cepillado. And I've broken down this step in one of my other videos that I'll post below. Um, what you do is one cepillado with each foot. Make sure that you have five counts. So you have one, two, three, four, and then five. And end with your feet flat. The foot that's in the front should end completely flat. And make sure that you twist your knees in so that way when you do the cepillo, the tacón, the sound is nice and clear. One, two, three, four, and five. 